Hey y'all. Welcome to Receiving Related. This is your first time here. I am so glad you clicked on this story for story time. My name is Tara Walker. Welcome. If you are a returning subscriber or a returning visitor, hey y'all, hey. Um, so yeah, you read it right. I got caught red head busted. Trying to be funny, trying to be with the get along game. Mm hmm. And got my butt busted. Okay, so this is seventh grade, right? I was in the choir. It wasn't a gospel choir, it was just called a choir at the time. And um, I had, I was singing little solos and everything like that. I've always been singing since I was six. Um, and you know, well liked by the instructor and everything and everybody else. But whatever reason, this time I wanted to be with, you know, remember I said try to find my identity. Wanted to be with the get along gang. They was doing this, I'm going to do it too. Mm -hmm. See what happens when you be trying to be do what everybody else do. So, uh, she had a period after our lunch period with another, um, I guess she had two choirs. Well, anyway, she had like a class and then she had like, that she taught and then she had um, like choir rehearsal with us. So this was the, the, the period after our, our, um, or during our lunch hour, she had a class that she taught. So it was on the way for us to go to our next class that her class was on the way. So the first day, okay, a classmate of mine knocked on the door and ran right and we all ran you know we ran and her class was like it was like right just on the edge of the corner where you whip around whatever like it was right right before you turn the corner so we got away with it that day of course and um we laughed thought it was funny so the next day guess who says they're going to do it right somebody asked me and i was like sure yeah i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it so guess who says yes and does it mm-hmm yep she be her so I knock on the door and then we all ran. She didn't catch us, right? The next day, okay? Cuz 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 that day couldn't just be enough. I couldn't just do it one time. I had to do it again, right? So I knock on the door this time and this time she was ready. You know, she must have heard us coming or knew about the time or whatever we was coming. She was at that door. Knocked on the door, she opened the door, and it was like I saw like a ghost. But I ain't even had time to run because she caught me. And red-handed, and um, this white lady, she was very, very, let me just put it like this. She was very, very serious about what she did. And rightfully so, because it was competitions won. We, I believe we won a competition as well. Um, She was serious about, you know what she did about her craft as a as a choir director but it was more so too because you know i was she saw me i was her student it wasn't like it was a random student i was her student and it was just like she was so shocked at my behavior i was shocked at my behavior so uh either that afternoon or the next day in class uh in choir rehearsal um she brought it up and she said you know i i, d I didn't know what to do um, I, but, and so I decided to give you all the decision of what to do, right? And I was like, are you serious? So she put the decision with the class whether I should be kicked out of the choir or not. I was like, I just knocked on your door. It was it's that serious. Like, you literally seriously thinking about kicking me out. But when I tell you this lady was serious about her craft, she was serious about her craft. So I had a friend. Uh, a buddy that I thought was my buddy. Um, I think I named him Billy in, in my book. And if he watched this, he he gonna know. I know he remember this. I know. I know, it's no way he can forget this. Um, my husband, who is who uh, is my husband now. I met him in middle school as well, but we wasn't in choir together. Um, and so uh, it was not him. Obviously, it was not him. But I had a buddy who I thought was my buddy, and I to this day don't know why he was mad mad at me around this time except for the fact that maybe i i lied about because uh, we used to talk on the phone all the time all the time for like hours and hours and hours and this one particular time excuse me i'm sorry he called i'm so sorry he called and i think i made up a lie like i made up my mom was calling me or something like that and i think he might i must have did it too many times and he caught me 
And I don't know if that was it or not. I tell you to this day, if it wasn't that, I had no earthly idea why he was mad at me. But but she gave she gave the class. She said she asked the class what they wanted to do, and so she said everybody that wants her wants me to stay. Um, anybody that wants me to be kicked out of the choir, raise your hand. He was the only one in the class. Who raised his hand? The only one. I thought actually it would be more people, but he was the only one. He was, but it wasn't even just the fact that he was the only one. It was him. He was supposed to be my friend. I looked at him like, "Are you serious?" He raised his hand and he. She said, "Okay." And then she said, "Everybody who wants to, we, we know that we we knew knew what the outcome was going to be with that." And then she asked though still. She said, "Everybody who wants Tara to stay, raise your hand." And everybody else raised their hand. Right. So then she had a nerd to ask him. She was like, "Why do you why 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 um why why do you why do you think um she should be kicked out?" And he was like, "Because she should know better." Like he said something, you know what I'm saying? Real, real, <laughs> real petty, you know. Now I was wrong. I was wrong. I take full accountability. I was wrong, but I was like, "Come on now, kicked out for um we used to call it um n i g g a knocking. That's what we used to call it. We was like kicked out for that. Like come on, but." For whatever reason, he was upset with me around that time, <laughs> and he was like, "Because she should know better." And da 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 da, she's supposed to be representing. And, and, and even everybody else, even other people, was looking at him like, "Dog, like you serious, right?" <laughs> um, but I, I, I was able to stay. You know, I did, I did not get kicked out. I learned my lesson, though. I had tears too. I used to cry. I still cry at the drop of a hat. But I had tears. I think my feelings was hurt because my little buddy was, you know. And then I would put, who likes to be put on the spot? You know what I'm saying? But I was able to stay. And I didn't get kicked out. I almost did, though. Or I think if, if, if it was her, she said she would have kicked me out. But I think one of the reasons, too, is because I was one of her, um, one of her lead soloists. And, um, you know, she probably, you, you know, had to think twice about kicking me out for that. So she gave she gave the um, choir the she gave everybody else the decision, um, but yeah. So that was it. This one is short. I almost got kicked out of my choir for we're gonna just gonna call it nick knocking, and my little buddy told him. I mean, my little buddy wanted me out. <laughs> I'm laughing because it's funny now, but back then I was distraught. Like I didn't talk. I don't think I. I think. I don't think I, yeah, it's in the book. I didn't talk to him even for the rest of that year, or it was a, it would be a very long time before I did again. Uh, so yeah, that's it. That's the story for today. I almost got kicked out of the choir for being uh silly, you know, and uh, trying to be along with the get along game, and uh, that's it. So if you want to come back for more stories, I encourage you to, and I also encourage you to subscribe if you have not already. I have a playlist. If you are new and you would like to watch other stories, it's literally called Story Time. Um, help yourself. <laughs> and uh, if you have, if you can relate to this story, one of your little friends told on you and you thought that was your friend, let me know. Or if you can relate, just hit me in the comments and say you can relate, okay? Because people receive and they can relate. Um, again, like I said, I hope you come back. If you would like to sow into the ministry, that information is also in the inbox below. To purchase my ebook or my paperback book of Page Girl, that link is in the information below. I also coach. I be I be forgetting to say this, um, but I also coach, and that information is also in the same link that you can get the book from. Um, yeah. Till next time. I love you, but know that God loves you more. Bye.